guys, it's Lee, and I'm back today with another Dollar Tree haul for you. I did find a few new items this time, so I'm kind of excited about that. I'm really excited for Easter to be over and, you know, find out what they're going to be putting in place of the Easter stuff. So I'm going to get started, show you what I picked up, and then, of course, I will also have some pictures of the items that I saw and didn't buy, but I thought you might like to see. So let me get started and show you what I did pick up. First up, I picked up two of these pet bowl placemats. They're the same. They're the pink kitty cat face, head, whatever. Um, they also have them in shape of a bone for a dog and they come in other colors. They get gross after a while, so you know, you kind of just have to replace them. So I grabbed two just so I would have them when I need them. It's actually about time to replace the one we have. Next up, I saw this button envelope set just sitting, you know, by itself. And I remembered that I need something like this to keep some documents in. Sounds so official. It's not that, you know, official really. So I said before, my son really likes the foaming hand wash. And I saw these, and I'd seen them before several times. Uh, but I decided to go ahead and pick up two of these Simply Antibacterial Foaming Hand Wash refills. So you get 32 ounces. He already has the uh, pump thing that, you know, this goes in. Words, man, sometimes they're tough. Um, so I just went ahead and got two of these so he can just refill the pump he already has. I picked up some Oreo Cakesters because they are delicious and I want Dollar Tree to stop selling them. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I really like these so I picked up a pack of them. These are a weakness. Sorry, my hair was in my mouth. Um, these are a weakness. I love them. So I grabbed a bag of those. And I went ahead and picked up two packs of the Columbia Enriched Egg Noodles. We love these noodles. Um, I love to make chicken and noodles, which is very simple. I think I've said it before. It's just baked chicken, buttered noodles, and peas. So it's something I had growing up, so it's kind of a comfort food, I guess. And they're cooked separately. You know, you bake the chicken, whatever, but then you combine it on your plate. I know. It's, maybe it's weird, but it's so good, and I like to have it every now and then. And my son really likes these noodles, um, just as a side dish for whatever he's cooking, so I grabbed two of them. I also picked up just one bag of the Utz Ripples cheddar and sour cream um, just because my son and his girlfriend liked them, saw them, so I grabbed one. Then I got some DVDs, and like I've told you probably a thousand times, okay, probably more like 20, I don't really watch movies. I mean, if my husband's watching them and they're on, I just am playing on my phone. I don't really have the patience to sit through movies unless they're super funny. Um, but these I got for my husband and son, and one of them is for me. Anyway, this one I did get for me, and it says digital copy included with purchase, which is good. Um, Rodney Yee's Best of Yoga. I don't think I've ever tried yoga, but I mean, I probably should. I need to do something. So yeah, I got this. It says three practices on one DVD. All right, so I got that. Then I picked this up because I thought maybe one of my sons might want it, and for $1.25, it was worth the risk. Pop Culture Bento Box, a taste of Japan's sci-fi superhero and animated favorites. Um, so here's everything that's on it. And I just thought they might like it, so I got it. So next, I picked this up for mainly for my husband because we used to watch this show back in the day. Gosh, when was it on? I can't even remember. It was a long, 1992, 1993, it says on the back. So yeah, we were married in 1990. Oh, 92 was the year our oldest was born. <laughs> anyway, we used to watch this show. So that's why I got that. He saw it actually and he was like, oh, that's a funny show. He saw the DVD. And then our youngest really loves horror movies and he really likes the bad ones too so I couldn't remember if I had gotten these for him before I, I don't know actually this one looks a little bit familiar Midnight Evil 
I think that guy's who looks familiar, but that doesn't mean anything. He could be in lots of horror movies, I guess. So I picked up this one and Death Day. Make a wish to survive. I can't even remember because there was the one time where he was with me and he picked up a bunch of them. And I don't actually remember if we got these or not. So I got those DVDs. And then I saw these, so I picked up two more of the Essentials Microfiber Fan Duster. I tried it on our fan here in the uh, family room, and I really, really liked it. So they're the kind that you take this little plastic piece, and they screw onto the um, handles they have. You know, the handles you use for the mop and broom and everything else. So I got two more because I really liked it, and I figured... You know, one day I'll need a replacement and I'll go back and they won't have them anymore. So I just grabbed two of those. I picked up some more of these little rubber bands. I got some in one of my last two hauls, but all they had was black. But I think these will be better in my hair because my hair is, I want to say it's like a light brown, but there's a lot of gray in it too. So I figured these would be better. I found this by Riviera. They actually had a few on it. It did not take pictures a few different hair accessories and this one you wrap around a ponytail my ponytail is pretty thin but I was thinking with the band it might stay in I just thought it was really pretty it's like little flowers so pretty just picked up some tweezers it's always good to have extra tweezers around these are made in Germany I got two of the Be Pure Uplifting Nourishing Softening Hand and Nail Gloves. Oh, they're touchscreen compatible, compatible as well. So how long do you leave these on? 15 to 20 minutes, so there we go. I just grabbed two of those. I picked up this Wet n Wild Perfume Roller and I, I don't know what it smells like at all but I'm going to open it and check it out right now. It looks like um it's okay. I think it smells okay. I have to give it a little while to see what I really think of it, but it's all right. So, I picked that up. In the store I found it, it was in like the Mother's Day section. So then I picked up some flower seeds and these were four for a dollar. I got this marigold, petite yellow marigold. I got two of the Cracker Jack mixed color marigold. And this flower garden mix. I always have really good intentions. <laughs> When I buy the flower seeds and I plant them and then I forget to water them and they never come up. So I'm going so I'm going to try to be better about it this year and actually, you know, take care of them. Next up, I picked up another one of the Bic Four Colors pens. This one has fluo yellow ink. I'm always losing my pens. I leave them places, you know. So I grabbed one more of those. Then I picked up some stickers. I know, shocking, right? I got these butterfly foil stickers because, I mean, they're butterfly and they're foil and they're so pretty. So I got those and you get 396 of them in there. I don't think I'll need butterfly foil stickers. I don't, won't need to buy them again for the rest of my life. <laughs> then I really don't have a use for these unless I start using my planner, like I said, I don't know how long ago that I was going to do, and put stickers in it. But look how beautiful these are. I mean, they are gorgeous. I, I had to get them. Those are so pretty. So these are metallic stickers and you get 12 of them in the pack. I had to, and these were just cute. So I picked them up and you get 96 in this pack. Next, I found these water and heat resistant bottle decor stickers. You get 16 pieces, but you'll see, you know, you basically get three stickers. They're so cute. 
I got two. Um, when my daughter comes home, I'm going to see if she wants one. I just thought these were so adorable. So cute. So I got those. And then I found something. I know you guys are going to be shocked that I bought it because I don't usually buy these. Let me move this out of the way so I can show you. Super out of character for me. But I bought socks. <laughs> these are by Coco and you get two pairs. So this one has um, rubber ducks and then on this side is clouds. I love these. I'm trying to see these fit size. These fit shoe size four to ten. So I got these. So adorable. And yes, I'm going to share these with my daughter. I got palm trees and these are beautiful hibiscus flowers. Gorgeous. And then I got this pair. It's cream with red hearts. And it came with black with white or gray polka dots. This set with the anchors and mustaches. I mean, come on, that is really funny. So I got those. Got stars with skull and crossbones. I got pink with kitty cats and coffee socks, cups of coffee with coffee beans. Trying to figure out where to put them. I got these little Scotties. They're red, the red socks with Scotties and white hearts. And on this side is gray with black paw prints. So cute. And then the last pack I got were pandas and koalas. How cute are they? They are so cute. I'm turning into like a sock hoarder, I think. Like I've said before, it's not like, you know, socks go bad. So just hang on to them till we need socks. Pull some out of the drawer. We're good to go. I will not have to buy regular price socks for a very, very long time. All right, so that's everything I picked up this time around at the Dollar Tree. And now I'm going to show you those pictures I mentioned in the beginning. So check those out and meet me right back here. Welcome back. I hope you enjoyed those pictures and I hope you enjoy this video. If you do, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the little bell so you get notified every time I upload new videos. You can also find me over on Instagram, Pinterest, and Facebook at Lee's Home 05. 
Thanks for watching. Bye.